Hello, hello. Good morning, journeyers. We are on day eight. Eight. Day 27. Day eight. And it is a beautiful morning in Maui. It's like five, what is it, babe? Six? Six. Oh, two. It's early. Six o'clock. We are saying goodbye to Maui. You have been beautiful. It might be my favorite island now. It was awesome, so much fun. And now we are going to Oahu, which is the most populated island. So much stuff to do on this island. Uh, some people, you know, obviously there's no island that stinks, but some people are a little less favorable of Oahu just because it's more crowded. But I think it has a good mix of city stuff to do, food, and also plenty of excursions and hiking and stuff. So we're gonna get all up in it and have all sorts of fun. But if this is y'all's first time, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any awesome adventures we have coming. If you haven't checked out the, our other videos from our Hawaii series, go on our page and check out our playlist and you can see our Hawaii series. So let's fly. <laughs> Go see Pearl Harbor. We're really some excited breakfast, about this. And breakfast. then we have a luau tonight. And that I am excited about. Luau at Disney. All right, people. We are here in Oahu. We've got our car, and now it is time for some breakfast. I'm excited. There, one of their <laughs> big pictures is pancakes right on the front door. So, you know what I'm getting. Let's eat. which is in the front part and then they have the restaurant which is on the side and you can tell this is a local spot for sure hey guys we uh, we just got to Pearl Harbor but the sneezing Bless already. Me. <laughs> Bless me. Child. We have our tickets. We have the tickets. To go out to the Arizona. It's free. It is free. First it's come, cool. first serve. You can reserve them, but you don't have to if you don't want to. We're only yeah. having to wait like 50 minutes. Not so bad. we'll explore some other stuff. We'll walk around. And... Just know there's going to be lots of people. Understandable. Uh, they do not allow bags inside. So they will take your bag, um, well, let me rephrase, they make you go get a locker, uh, but you literally will not be able to go in. And when I mean bag, I mean like fanny pack, they won't even fanny, allow you yeah. a fanny pack. This is literally all they would allow. Pretty much take in what you can carry. Yeah. So just know that like ahead of time if you don't want to pay the five bucks, if you do then you just walk to the side and you pay five bucks and they hold it for you and then when you leave you give them the ticket and you're good to go. So.
it's just a heavy feeling. You know, it's it's not even so much the guy who's our tour guide on the boat on the air taking us out to the Arizona Rob. He he phrased it in a way. Oh, Bob, sorry. Yeah, Bob. He phrased it in a way that really made sense. He said, you know, it's not just a memorial. This is it's a gravesite. It's a cemetery. When the Arizona was hit, the uh, bomb hit in the munitions, and the, he said that about a million pounds of explosives went off. The boat sunk in nine minutes, and it burned for three days. You just drive by it, and over 1,100 guys died, just gone. And uh, one of the questions they get asked is if you can go in and have they been able to try and recover the bodies. There's no bodies to recover because, first of all, if it burned for three days, and the people that were in there literally got cremated. So it literally is a cemetery. And it just shows you what these guys were willing to do for their country and just the sacrifice they made is, it's like a, a good heavy, just a remembrance and, a, and an honor to them. Uh, but it's definitely something you need to experience. Just a, it was a powerful, powerful day in the sense of you know, like it said in one of the videos we watched, it brought America together and united us. And I think that's something that we need today, too. So I'd like to show you guys our Airbnb. Finished up Pearl Harbor and we headed, a lizard, headed to our Airbnb. Just got there, got the tour from Lori. She's awesome. You guys need to check out this place. So this is our own little private little walk-in area. This is the backyard. That's our view. I will be hanging out there. As you can see, pretty stinking spectacular. So we've got our own little private quarters down here. Two bedrooms, got a bathroom, pull-out couch, everybody gets a bed. Happy, happy, happy. Give you guys a tour of the inside. This is uh, the bathroom. We've got a washer, dryer, nice little kitchen area. Little kitchenette area. Microwave, toaster, fridge. And then, Kelsey and I's room. She's trying to learn how to play it. She's trying. It's okay, you got time. So we're actually gonna do something unique today, which is we're gonna do a, we're gonna make this a two-part uh, video. Some of the stuff we've done, doing in Oahu is actually like multiple things. Uh, and so what that means is for us and you guys, we didn't want to cram too much stuff in one video, so we're going to post multiple videos of days where we have lots of stuff, and this is one of them, because today we went to Pearl Harbor and we kind of spent all day there, uh, for the most part. Uh, I want to say we were there for, I don't know, we were there for at least three or four hours. Uh, got a lot of cool content and experienced a lot of fun stuff, and tonight we are going to go to a luau, so I... I'm going to sign out for today. So we appreciate you guys watching the episode. I uh, hope you enjoyed yourself. Make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any awesome videos we have coming. Uh, give us a big like and let us know if you've ever been to Pearl Harbor or if you'd like to go. And we will see you in a few on our luau. Peace.